Blessed Mother, save us. I lost him in the tunnels, but the swamp has him now. Radrim, we were about to finish without you. He's still alive? Where is he? At the end of his bloody trail. This way. Sir, I need to speak with him. Then do so, Horadrim. Zorath! <coughs> oh, Elias. Was all this worth it then? Truly? I brought Lilith to Sanctuary. A thing no one thought possible. And when hell rises to sweep across this world, I should be there beside her, ready to push it back. You left me alone to cross the lines you would dare not attempt. And you have nothing to show for it. You are nothing but a wasted life. Do not look to forgive me, old man, because it is you who brought us here. Was it worth it? That is a coward's question, Lorath. It suits you. Elias of Aronok. Oh, spare me. Of your own free will, you swore an oath to the Tree of Whispers. This is not the life I deserve. <laughs> The tree does not forget oaths, and it does not forgive debts. It is time to let go.
I hear laughter on the wind. Elias' head hangs from the Tree of Whispers, and your soul stone is attuned. This is where I leave you. Leaving? We go to face Lilith. I had hoped you would join us. I know the weight of your reasons, but Lilith remains your concern. Mine lies elsewhere. This is farewell, then. And uh, thank you for the tea. Take care of yourself, Donan. She called me by my name. Lorath won't believe. Where is he? I've not seen him since... since Elias spent his last words calling him a coward. And to prove his courage, he what? Rode to face Lilith alone? Elias never told us where to find her. But his head is on the Tree of Whispers. So the tree knows where Lilith is going. Lorath could ask, but he'll have to pay the price. What price? The same Elias paid. Eternity on the tree. Brother, no. Get to the tree now! Stop him!
ready. on fury. Yeah! 
swamp is always watching. It knows why you've come. It knows each and every bone that has sunk to the bottom of the black mud since time began. It sees all and more. And its wisdom grows with every fool who makes a pact with the tree. Not yet. Watch after the child, will you? Do not let her make a bargain. What is that? An effigy? Come over. Uh, let me see it. Uh huh? This is just an ordinary doll. Why didn't you say so? It should look like me. It is me. I made this for someone. A child. Long ago. My child, perhaps? Yes. It was my child's. And she had one just like it that looked just like her too. Fitting that this one has been carried back to me by the swamp after all this time. Maybe someday it will bring her back too. What is it now? A curious kind of venom from the Nangari. I see. You know, this is their place. We all came here from elsewhere. But not them. No. Even I don't know how long they've been here, or how they came to be. But this venom is clear, because the Nangari it came from is about to begin molting. Or at least it was, I assume. You must have killed it. Yes. Of course. Perhaps the season of molt will begin soon. It's said to be lucky to keep some in your house. But it's only lucky if it's not full of parasites. That's what I always say. Bah. I'll be fine. Just wore myself out. Packing to visit my neighbors. They've got it worse than me. Poor souls. Infected, forsaken. Left to wander the swamp until it takes them. Since you're here, help an old woman. Take these supplies to Baridan, Duraya, and Raldine. Treat them kindly, or the swamp will hear of it. It begins with the scratch of a tiny thorn. The flesh is open, and the swamp flows in. Slowly, painfully, it grows inside until the swamp is all that you are. One fury. Huh. 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 
Someone there? to fury.
I'm not ready. She says, I'll find my own herbs, thank you. Cure myself and leave this swamp for good. You can take that shite to Beridan. He'll swallow it gladly. Never strays far from the old hag's hut. As for Weldon, who knows? I'm not his mother. I'm still buried in. Thank you. And think him away for me. Without these herbs, the days pass like years. I'm so sorry. Don't be. This place can be rather peaceful once you get to know it. But enough of that. You should try to visit Roldin in the northeast. He's a good boy. For my brother. He's sick too. I've not seen him in days. I was afraid he'd grown roots. They, they attacked me. Tried to take me somewhere. One of them mentioned the camp by the coast. They took my brother. Don't worry. I'll look into it.
Folk think we are monsters. There are men in this world who would take a dying boy, hack the source from his body, and sell them like herbs to the alchemists. But you've sated the swamp with their blood. Go now. Live with our gratitude.
Lilith has been two steps ahead of us for far too long. The tree knew where to find her. I asked. Its answer was worth the price. Worth the price? You owe the tree your head. The day you die, you'll be taken to hang here with the others. And what? Did I need your permission? It's done. Put it aside. While we stand here in the mud, Lilith is on her way to absorb Mephisto's power. She has found a gateway to hell, and she approaches with the key. Where is the gate, brother? Under Chaldean. Surely there will be some resistance. None. The fools welcomed her in. It is up to us to stop her and imprison her in the Soul Stone. This is all that matters. And if Lilith has already passed through the gate? We follow her into hell. I will do everything in my power to get us there. The four of us alone? This is lunacy. Not lunacy, child. Duty. We will meet in Tarsarak to prepare. Pray we are not too late. <laughs> 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 A strange thing, knowing where you'll go when you die. One less damn mystery to worry about, at least. Did I make the right choice? I did what I had to. We needed answers and we got them. Lilith was poised to storm the very gates of hell. Astaroth and the deal, Rathra and the key, it had all been leading to this. But what we didn't know was that while we were lost in the swamp, Inarius and the cathedral were launching a campaign to strike at Lilith. Their battle would leave the world a wasteland. And whoever won would show no mercy to what was left. Our only hope was to reach Lilith before Inarius. But we couldn't have predicted what happened next. <laughs>